Hello, 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 everyone, and welcome to Mini Airways. We're in the full launch. We've checked out the demo before here on Tooth & Scrubs Gaming, but now we are in the full launch. I will have a massive surprise for this game at some point. It's not quite ready. It's coming, but I will have a, a pretty big surprise. And while we're waiting for that surprise, I thought we would check out some of the levels. Levels, uh, I put a B in there, not a, a, a V. Uh, and we're gonna hop back to London. We've already done London and New York, but uh, I thought we would start start fresh. Uh, so let's go ahead and get uh, get London going here. Um, there we go. Got to click there, <laughs> not uh, not anywhere else. So this game, kind of like some of the other mini games that we played, is you got to get people to to where they're going. Looks like we're at the London City Airport. So pretty simple, we guide the airplanes to where they're going. So we got inbound and outbound traffic. And for this map, we only got one runway. Other maps will have multiple runways. So actually let's have this guy go this way. We'll get the green heading towards that green. So it's gonna get pretty hectic here, pretty quick. Um, so unlike many motorways and many Metro, which these are made by different companies, by the way, um, you know, we get to expand our infrastructure at the end of every day. But sometimes, you know, it's not like many motorways where it's set, right? Like, this is more, we have, you know, the airplanes that we're guiding around. So I could have this guy do loop-de-loops all day and be just fine. Our goal is to obviously not do that and get them in and out as quickly as possible. So let's see if we can get him to do that. No. So we'll have him keep kind of flying this way. And then we'll have him turn and hit that airport. Now you can see this bottom bar here with all these planes building up. We don't want that to build up and start flashing or uh, we lose. Or if we have planes crash in the air on the runway, uh, we'll lose that as well. So like I said, we're kind of managing a lot more things. It's a little more uh, reactionary than the other games. Because you can always, we can pause, but we can't like change our road setup or where these dots are or anything like that. So we just got to kind of be cognizant of all that. And not do anything too crazy. So here we go. We got that guy starting to spin here. Um, we'll have this plane start to fly south a little bit. And then while they're doing that, we'll get this other orange plane taken off. And let's see if he can... No, they're probably going to crash. Actually, see you see that red flash there? Yeah, we don't want that to happen. So we'll have this guy spin around a little bit. And then we'll get him landing here in a second. Uh, we'll have this guy go straight north. Um, why these guys are spinning around, as you can see, it's already getting very hectic. Um, as these guys are spinning around, we'll get this um, this blue plane taken off. That red plane, I guess I never put in at the right thing. So we'll get that guy going there. Let's get this blue plane taken off here. So we'll have to watch the blue and the red. Hopefully they don't collide into each other. Um, okay, blue, pop on down that way. Let's see if you can spin there. Um, we might be able to sneak the yellow out once this other gray plane lands. This red's going to circle. Um, yeah, I need you to, to go there. Okay, red. We'll have to do some some movements on this red here because I suspect if we don't, it will just continuously spin in circles. Okay, so we'll get this yellow up and going. Let's get the red going this way. Let's get the yellow. Uh, okay, so we're at the end of the day. Let's see, what do we want? We could get the navigation waypoint, which upon reaching the waypoint, the aircraft will follow the direction of the arrow. The landing waypoint, upon reaching this waypoint, the aircraft will, aircraft will automatically land on the designated runway. Expedite. Oh, we're going to take faster turns, definitely. Traffic, traffic. Okay, so I need yellow to start to spin. He's coming in for a landing. I'm going to have you kind of whip around and see if you can... No, I want you to go that way a little bit more. Um, we might be able to get this gray plane to land... Yeah, we're going to have him come straight in. Red plane, you're going to kind of zip around like that. Perfect. Uh, and we already got two planes waiting to take off. Um, and we won't be able to sneak anyone out while this other gray plane lands. But we should be able to once it lands. Uh, we got this gray plane coming in from the northwest. We'll hopefully be able to bring him straight in. Um, so let's get him directed like that. So then you got to watch when they're on the runway. They can still crash on the runway. And we, we don't want that to happen because I did that, I think, in both the episodes in the demo that we played. Uh, so we got to be cognizant of that. We'll get the blue taken off that way. Um, we're going to have the yellow take off as well and come along, come out and around the, the long way with that gray plane still coming in from the northwest. Hopefully we can sneak this red plane out too. I think we'll be able to. Um, yeah, that yellow plane's out of the way. We'll get this next guy going here. 
All right, we're at 12 planes to their destination. 13 once that blue plane hits. Get him going there. Another gray plane coming in from the northwest, sort of. So we're just going to have him come straight in. We'll see if this red dot moves once it gets uh, checked off by this red plane. If it doesn't, we should be in good shape at getting this red plane out. All right, so we um, missed some of the initial craziness. Or we've gotten through some of the initial craziness, which will hopefully now allow me to talk to you guys a little bit. So tell me what's going on, how you guys are doing, uh, what you're thinking of some of the newer videos. Uh, you know, this has always been a hobby, but always looking to take it to the next level. So any feedback you want to give, I would love to hear that feedback from you guys. Always looking to make these better or as the best I can. All right. Uh, I don't think we can squeeze that yellow out there. Um, we'll bring it out in between these two planes. So we'll have that guy come like that. Once this gray plane lands, which will be 18, blue will be 19. We'll get this yellow up in the air. All right, so he's landing. So now if I were to let it go and he were to move and they were to crash or they would crash, uh, we would lose the map. So we don't want to do that. I think the first time we played, we got 45 or something like that. I should have looked at that beforehand. Um, let's get this red guy up in there too. So I'd like to, to try and beat 45. It's kind of, you know, beat my goal or beat my uh, record from last time. We got a pink that just spawned and there's the pink. Um, okay, so red, I need you to spin around. Let's get that gray landing. Hopefully we can, I think we'll be able to get this pink out and head in that westernly direction before that gray gets to the point where I have to worry about it. Um, let's take airspace, just make our map a little bit bigger, more uh, room to, to move some planes around here. Now these are probably gonna start chirping at us here in a second. Yeah, so let's get that pink starting to head a little bit north. Um, actually, I need you to head directly north like that okay that looks like that should be good you can start turning like that that red's gonna make it gray's coming in yellow what we might do on the southerly plane let's bring him around this way uh, we'll bring him east and then bring him in from the the eastern approach or coming in from the east that way we can get this yellow and the the red off even though that red just moved over to the southeast corner um so we'll keep an eye on that let's get this gray plane down and then we're going to get this yellow plane in the air. And then we'll... Okay, keep bringing this gray plane around. And then we'll have him come in and land here. There we go. Okay, let's do this. Let's bring the red plane... Let's get the red plane in the air too. And he'll just kind of have to, to spin around a little bit. And we'll get that. And then we should be able to have him land directly from that direction. That yellow is going to go there. That red's going to go there. Um, that yellow did move. Uh, ooh, we got two yellows in a row. Okay, we'll get this guy down and then we'll just conga line those two yellows out and have them spin around as we hit 26 planes here about halfway through day three. Um, so we're moving right along here in London. Uh, okay, we might only be able to get one yellow out, which is fine because then we can just have the other yellow head out directly west. Hopefully I'm saying this stuff correctly. I am by no means a pilot or let alone an air traffic controller. Even though in high school I did, you know, you take those those tests that tell you what you're supposed to do and whatnot. The test I took was, I think it told me I should be either an air traffic controller or a mortician. And uh, I definitely didn't want to do either of those. Okay, so you can see here in the bottom, it's starting to chirp at us. So we'll get this yellow up in the air here in a second. Then hopefully maybe a in short order after that, a, a blue. Um, a little worried about these yellows because they're gonna be right on top of each other. Hopefully that yellow dot doesn't move on us. Um, and if it does, that's okay. We'll, we'll handle that accordingly. All right, we'll get this blue up in the air too. That yellow can go there, that yellow can go there. And then this blue is gonna immediately turn north um, and head towards that, that blue there. We'll have this gray plane conga line in behind the other gray. Uh, gray plane and we'll get another blue in the air here shortly all right he's landing we'll let him start flashing and then we'll be able to get another blue off um i don't know if we'll get both of these blues off but we'll find out here let's get him going here uh allow later aircraft to exit the queue to take off in advance expedite or take off waypoint upon takeoff the aircraft will immediately head towards this waypoint and upon reaching the waypoint um We'll do, I'm not sure if I'm quite confident to do these waypoints yet because they seem kind of scary to me. Let's get, let's get exit. 
That way we have a little bit more control uh, and that we don't always have to take the next in line. You know what I mean? Um, so let's get another blue aircraft in the air here. Again, we're kind of hoping that blue dot doesn't move on us, but if it does, we will adjust accordingly. Um, I don't think I have time to get another blue aircraft in the air. That's okay. Uh, let's just kind of watch this dot, and as these two gray place, planes come in, we'll, we'll make sure we don't need to do anything too crazy. Once this guy lands, God, we got two more blues. We'll get, um, get these guys going. All right, so he's landing. He's going to start to flash here in a second. Another gray plane looks like it's coming in from directly south. We got a lot of blue planes wanting to come in. Um, okay, so let's just, we're going to keep doing what we're doing. All right, he's taking off. Let's get this guy going. And you're going to spin around like that. All right, let's see if, yeah, we'll just have you keep coming this way. Blue, you're going to come, all right, keep coming that way a little bit more. Uh, and we got an orange there. Okay, so we'll get that blue spinning that way. That gray's coming in. We'll squeeze the orange out, I think, before the blue, just to allow some some of that traffic, those blue aircrafts to, to pass. Someone coming in from the northeast. All right, uh, we got an eye on you there, bud. Get that guy coming in that way. We'll get the orange going here. And then we'll have a yellow. We might try to do the yellow next. That blue might just have to wait a few minutes, and that's okay. All right, get him going there. You're going there. Nice. I think we're good for now. Get this guy down, and we'll get the yellow up in there next. I wouldn't mind having a little bit more uh, space here for planes because we can only hold two. Yeah, and that guy's going to start chirping at us here in a second. So we'll get this gray down, and then we'll get the yellow up in the air. And then we got someone coming in from the west. That might change our, our traffic pattern here in a second. So we'll get him down. We might even, depending on which way this orange goes, um, that orange is going that way. All right, let's get this blue up in there. We should have time. That way then, blue's out. This gray lands. This other gray should be able to land. Uh, and we should be able to get the orange out once this gray lands, I think. We'll have to see how it times. Um, they might be kind of chasing each other here, especially if that orange kind of being in the southeast. I think we should be able to to get him out about three quarters of the way through day four. Yeah, we can get this orange out uh, once this guy lands. Start flashing at me, my man. Okay, that can go that way. Get this guy coming in this way, uh, and we'll get our orange heading south here in a second immediately. All right, so this gray should go down, and then we'll pop the red out next. Um, as this day ends, hopefully we can get more space because uh, we are starting to build up quite a bit of traffic. Um, okay, so we need this guy to get down. Uh, expedite. Uh, doo -doo -doo. I guess we'll take expedite again because, again, I'm still kind of afraid of the waypoints. Um, okay, about halfway through there, day five. Um, all right, I need to get these guys going here. All right, come on, start to start to flash. All right, red's going to go. Yeah, pink's going to start chirping at me. I'll grab the yellow next. Um, let's get the yellow going here. And then we're going to have these two grays get in here. They should be good like that. Get this guy going that way. And then the pink maybe. We'll get the pink up after this other gray lands. Uh, oh, and the orange. Either or will work because they're both going in this opposite direction of where we got our traffic coming in from. Uh, he's two clicks out. Um, I think it's kilometers, right? I don't think they would measure it by miles. We'll get him to start going that way. Um, and we'll get our orange lined up on the tarmac here to take off. Let's see if we can squeeze another one out here. Uh, God, that sounds wrong. <laughs> let's see if we can get another airplane up in the air. Um, let's see. We should be able to get... Yeah, we can get this pink going here. Um, and then we'll see where that yellow lands. And we might do the yellow after this, this gray plane lands here too. I can, I'm can. i starting to see where waypoints might be beneficial because um, you can kind of direct people there and they can do what they need to do. We're just going to have this guy come directly across this way. Uh, let's see if we can get this guy to start to spin. All right, once he starts to flash, we'll get our yellow up in the air. Um, and then we might even chase him with the second yellow. Uh, I think that's what I want to do. We're going to chase him with the second yellow, yeah. All right, let's get that guy going. You're going to start going that way. Got someone six clicks out up north. Um, and we're just going to have these guys conga line in. Uh, I don't think we can get anyone out quite yet. I wonder if I can spin the traffic. Okay, we're going to spin the traffic uh, and have it start coming in from the west like that. Um, I'm going to have you come down just to touch, my man. And then once this guy lands and clears, we'll get this blue, maybe even a green off here. 
and let's let's just see what happens. Get that guy going, and then that yellow is gonna go there. Perfect. Let's get this green lined up. Get this green on the runway here. I'm gonna have you start to come in like that. You, my friend, are gonna come all the way across. All right, we can get one more plane off here, and that's gonna make me feel a lot better because it's gonna be tight between these two. Um, okay, so he's up in the air. We should be good with that. He'll come all the way across. We'll get these guys down like that. We might be able to squeeze a blue or the yellow out here. Um, yeah, we can squeeze one more blue out. Once this guy lands and starts to flash, we'll drop one more on it. All right, get that guy going like that. He's coming in. This guy's coming across. We have another one coming in from the northwest we need to keep an eye on. Um, let's see. If we just bring you straight down, we might be able to bring him in right behind this guy but before the other guy. Oh, waiting area. Okay, let's take more waiting area. Perfect. Okay, so he's coming down like that. He's coming across like that. We're going to have you come in like that. We'll get the yellow and maybe even the blue up in the air. Let's do the blue first because um, it still hasn't removed that waypoint. So I would like him to, to hit that waypoint. Uh, someone coming in from the direct east we'll keep an eye on. We'll have him come up and around and follow these guys. Um, so we'll have this guy go that way. Let's get the red going here, and then we'll do the yellow. That should give this uh, plane in the Far East plenty of time to get around. All right, so the red's up in the air. We'll get him heading towards his waypoint. The blues are heading towards yours. theirs. Let's see. Eh, I want you to go just a little bit more. Um, ooh, I do not like that plane that just spawned. Let's get this yellow up in the air here. He should be out of the way before this gray lands. That should be good. Okay, we'll see if we can bring these guys in behind each other like that. Um, we'll bring the yellow here. I feel like I'm yelling in the microphone. I apologize, guys, but we're doing pretty well. 61 planes uh, moved around to their respective destinations. Um, actually, I wonder if... No, we're going to keep keep our conga line going the way we got it going. Um, no, keep going that way just a little bit more. Um, let's get a green up in the air. Uh, yeah, we'll get the green up in the air, and we'll just kind of... He'll have to do uh kind of fit in between these guys here so let's bring him north like that um i wonder if we can squeeze the let's see if we can okay we'll do that he's coming across like that he's coming across like that we got a lot of inbound flights that are oh i can't move him okay red we'll get red up in the air next it was going to start chirping at me but that's okay i think we've avoided that um we'll bring that guy in like that actually let's just bring him down um and bring that that way we'll start bringing yeah it's going to be tight here in a second um i just need to get some of these planes down that's starting to chirp at me too um okay we're going to bring you south like that even though now we have someone coming in from the south too um okay so we got that we got that uh we'll see if we can squeeze this blue plane out of here um it's going to get interesting here in a second folks but that's why you're here to see me fail Okay, green's going there, red's going there. Let's get that blue going that way. He's going to land. Um, I think if I, I think I can get a pink out. Um, we'll have him come in this way. And then, actually, let's just have you. Okay, good. I can use this as a waypoint, right? And then have you use that as a waypoint. Yeah, I am, I am seeing where waypoints would be extremely advantageous at this point. Um, oh, I must have clicked off the map for a second. Okay. Um have you come that way we got that other blue coming up in the air um let's get her waiting area bigger okay so we got that guy going there blue i need you to go there um i kind of want you to start heading towards that green there pink then you should be able to drop down i don't think there should be any issues with that get that guy spun around like that uh we can't get anyone out quite yet and that's okay let's get you heading this way okay you're gonna go I don't even know if I'll have time to get anyone out before this other plane comes down. Um, actually, yeah, we can get that yellow out of there, uh, hopefully. It's going to be, they're going to be on each other's heels, but that's okay. So yellow's going to get out of there just in the nick of time. Um, okay, so he's coming in, and then probably him. Wow, we got a lot of inbound traffic here. Okay, um, let's just start getting, oh, they might, nope, okay, good. That didn't happen. Um, okay, you need to, yeah, vector around that for a second. Um, I'm going to have you follow him. We'll get another pink in the air. And then let's just have you go that way. And we're going to have you go that way. Um, and then 
Keep going this way, my friend. Oh, you need a turn. Okay, we got quite a bit of traffic in the air. Um, all right. So let's just all go that way. 75 people moved here. All right, let's see if I can get you to spin. Red, I want you to come around. Pink, I need you to start to come around. Um, yeah, I can't even get anyone up in the air right now. There's going to be a couple planes here that are going to be uh, pretty close. So he should be spinning around like that. We got one, two, three, four, five, five planes up north um, that are not in the greatest of formations. Um, I don't know how I'm going to fix this. Let's just, um, yeah, we'll be fine. We got this. Let's have this guy start heading north too. Um, all right, can I have you spin like that? Okay, we're going to get this guy to start to spin in. I'll have you start to come south a little bit. I'm going to need to get some... Of these other colors up in the air um okay start flashing okay let's get this pink in the air you can start coming this way um okay we are really gonna be we are gonna be really um doing some crazy stuff here in a second okay you're gonna go there you're gonna go there and i think if i bring you in next and then can i bring you all the way in um yeah everything's trafficking me right now uh, spin that way. Don't, oof, that came close. Okay, you, you, you. Um, that like that. Hopefully those pinks don't crash. I think they should be fine. Um, have that guy. Okay, so that pink dodged. Um, start having that come that way. We're going to take more airspace. Um, even though we're going to fail here because I think we just ran out of time. Wow, that was pretty fun. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. What do we move, 82? Nice, 82 across eight days. Oh my God, 999, how are we supposed to do that? That's absolutely crazy. Anyways, let me know what you guys thought of Mini Airways. It was pretty fun, I enjoyed it. Hopefully I wasn't yelling in the air too much. I felt like I was. Uh, like I said, big surprise coming up. So if you wanna see that surprise, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming, Gaming so you get all this great content on time and in an orderly fashion. If not, I'll see you guys in the next Mini Airways video.